This is Liz from QueenLeda.com and today we're going to be talking eyeliner. Tips and tricks, a little bit about products and a little bit about tools and we'll learn a lot so stay tuned. So if you watched my video on how to prep your eyes for makeup then you know how to do that. If you haven't then click on this link right here and that will take you to that video. So eyeliner. A lot of people have um, a fear of eyeliner. I think that with the right tools and the right technique and a lot of practice and uh, patience, everybody can do eyeliner and I think it's a look that looks good on everybody. Um, whether it, And it doesn't have to be black eyeliner, it, it could be any color you want. It can be black, it can be brown, it can be uh, dark blue, it can be light blue, it can be turquoise, it can even be pink. Check out my Pretty in Pink video, which is actually my first makeup tutorial, uh, where I do uh, a pink eyeliner, which I think looks great on pretty much everyone, especially darker skins. It looks amazing. So eyeliner, there's a, a couple of things to remember when we're, um, when we're doing eyeliner. First thing is what kind of eyeliner we're going to use. Um, are we going to use a liquid eyeliner or are we going to use a gel eyeliner? Are we going to use a pencil eyeliner? Are we going to use a uh, powder eyeliner or an eyeshadow with a mixing medium? So I think the best thing for someone to start with is either a gel or a liquid eyeliner. With a gel eyeliner, you're going to need a brush. With a liquid eyeliner, uh, the brush is going to be inside, uh, is going to be provided for you. Um, and uh, especially if you're using a, a pen liquid eyeliner, then that's even easier. For some people. For some people, pens are extremely difficult and they find it easier to work with a pen, with a, um, a brush, a makeup brush. So, it's there's no one right way there's no you know you have to practice and see what works for you what you're comfortable with what works with your eye shape what works with your level of uh, technique and um, and all that and what works with the look that you want to achieve so today we're going to be talking about three basic lines that you can do three basic eyeliner shapes uh, let's say that are sort of basic and can get you started if you want to learn how to do your eyeliner and if you want to start wearing eyeliner. So today I'm going to use a gel eyeliner. This is from e.l.f. Um, I really like it because it's super cheap and it actually works really well. I'm also going to use a very very fine, uh, let's see, I don't know if you can see that, but anyway, this is a very, very fine tipped um, brush. This is actually a, a nail art brush. It's not a makeup brush. So what I'm going to do for my first basic line is I'm basically going to take my eyeliner and I'm just going to softly draw while looking down. This is very important. Take a mirror and, oh, hello, mirror glare. <laughs> Take a mirror and look down into the mirror. Basically what you're doing is you're sketching out a tiny, tiny line on the base of your lashes. And as you're going towards the inner corner of the eye, you're going to sort of work a little bit lighter. So you start at the end when you have a lot of product or more product on your brush. And you work your way in. So by the time you get to the inner corner of the eye, you have just a a tiny little bit of product on your brush so you can do a really really thin line. The makeup brush is key with this this look with this really fine eyeliner line. 
I'm gonna do the other eye. The secret to doing a really fine and straight line, or straightish, it's not really straight because it's, you know, you're following the, curved of your, the curve of your eye, is to not rush it and to go really, really slow and sort of do small strokes. Don't try to do the whole thing at once because it's just not going to work, especially in the beginning when you're starting out and, you know, you don't know what you're doing. So take your time. Do it slowly, 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 and you'll get there. And don't worry about it. I mean, you know, it's makeup. Who cares if you mess up? It doesn't matter. So we did our first line, which is basically a really, really thin line at the base of the lashes. And this can, especially if you do it with a, a, a light color, like a brown or a dark blue, this can be great for you know, in the morning, going to work, or whatever, something light. Now, if, say you're, you want to sort of take this from day to night, then you can do a cat eye. Do, doing the cat eye, you will find that using a, a slanted eyeliner brush is um, probably the easiest way to do it. And I'm just going to show you how to do it right now. So again, with my gel eyeliner, I'm going to take a little bit of product and I'm just basically I'm moving my brush inside the the, the um, gel liner and I'm smoothing it out so I'm loading up both sides of the brush or you can just dip it in doesn't matter so what you're gonna do is basically when you're doing a cat eye or a flick what you the the um, the way you do it is you imagine if you wanted to extend your lower lash line towards your eyebrow. So that's basically the um, angle that you want to work with, which is the angle that is going to look the most flattering on your eyes. So <clears throat> it doesn't have to be that angle, but this is the most flattering angle for your eyes. So basically what you do is you take your angled brush and you do a line at the, at the edge of your eye. And then what you do, again, looking down helps a lot. Then what you do is you connect that line with the rest of it. So you're creating a triangle and you're just filling it in. And there you have it. You have a, a very simple cat eye that looks right for your eyes. Let's zoom in and do the other eye. If you feel like you need to sort of go in and fix it, then you can take your small brush and, you know, do a little bit of touch up, fix the angle, fix the tip of the cat eye. And that's it. Look at your eyes, see if they're even. In this case, they're not. <laughs> go in. Make them even. Again, the secret is don't freak out if your uh, lines are not perfect. Don't freak out if your lines are, you know, a little bit wonky. It doesn't matter. You know, most of the time, nobody will know. Another tip before you finish off your eyeliner is to basically if you're usually after 30 this happens after 30 if you're over 30 or if you have monolids or if you have especially sort of saggy skin on your eyes um, then 
a good trick to remember is to lift your eyelid very very gently and to go over and sort of fill in where your eyelid meets your lashes because if you have saggy skin on your eyes or if you're older you know you're you'll notice that it's kind of white it hasn't been um, <clears throat> the eyeliner didn't get a chance to get in there and then to finish off you'll just take your black mascara or whatever mascara you like wearing whatever you want and of course if you're like me and my dad will probably say that I look like I've been punched in the face thanks dad um, <laughs> so if you're like me and you have under eye circles and under eye bags then you will need to use some concealer and that's it I hope you guys enjoyed these little tips and tricks on how to apply eyeliner if you have any questions then please don't hesitate to ask me in a comment below um, if you have any suggestions on any more tips and tricks that you would like me to you know show you then please let me know and don't forget to subscribe, give me a thumbs up if you like this video, and follow me on social networks, and I'll see you very soon in the next video. Bye-bye!